To change your RSL torque wrench from a square drive to a hex drive, start by removing the reaction foot. Turn the dial lock to one or the other side positions to loosen and remove the reaction foot. Next remove the four main cap screws with an Allen wrench that is supplied with your unit. There are two cap screws on each side. Once all four bolts are out, you may separate the power head and the square wrench housing by turning it slightly and pulling it apart. Now take your power head and apply some lubricant to the push block area before reassembling it. Also put some molly paste on the exposed area of the pawl. Now take your power head and reassemble it to the wrench hex head. This retractor pin has got to fit into this slot. Turn it at an angle and push them together. Make sure it is engaged and you can't pull them apart. Put your two screws in on top. Don't tighten all the way up until you get the others started to get them in line. Turn it around and then tighten these in place. Your last maintenance step is to clean your tool of the exterior molly paste. Reinstall the reaction arm and flip the dial lock to the side to lock the foot on. Dial lock must be in the lock position before using the tool.